Alamo police are investigating a shooting that left one person injured and a 14 year old in police custody. Fox 59 was able to obtain surveillance footage of that incident. Reporter Claire Curry talked to Kokomo residents about what happened. Neighbors tell me that kids hang around Waugh and State Street every day and with crime on the rise, they say the shooting last night wasn't surprising. Everywhere from like five, ten years old. I mean, they're always riding their bikes and everything up here. Usually it's a good neighborhood throughout the day, but at night it's just, I don't know, man. As you can see in this security footage, a group of people can be seen walking down the road at around 9.30 p.m. when they cross paths with someone on a motorcycle. Just minutes later, two shots were fired. My girlfriend, I heard the shots and she came and got me and she was all freaked out and everything. The man on the motorcycle was hit with one of the bullets. At last check, that 18-year-old is in stable condition in an Indianapolis hospital. Police have arrested a 14-year-old in connection to the shooting. It's sad. Um, they don't realize um, what the outcome for the families will be. We have experienced that. Organizers of a local nonprofit, Riri's Place, have lost three children to shootings. The organization is a resource for people grieving a loved one lost to gun violence. They believe there's a need for more kid-friendly options to get them out of the streets. I think, personally, there's nothing for them to do. And now everybody has a gun, so now everybody's just hanging out and things get stuff gets heated and then bullets are flying. Police ask if anyone has information on the incident to contact their detectives or Crime Stoppers. Reporting in Kokomo, Claire Curry, Fox 59 News. Claire